you, Franklin. Hanover County Public Schools appointing a new superintendent tonight, acting that is. Dr. Lisa Pennycuff will now lead the district while the school board searches for a permanent replacement. That decision was made at tonight's meeting. Chantel Davis joining us live where that meeting took place and she has the latest. Tell us, Chantel. Yes, Riley Kerr. So that meeting tonight took less than a half hour and the school board went ahead and accepted Superintendent Michael Gill's resignation while choosing a superintendent from another um, locality, Prince George. Actually, she just announced her retirement, but she will now serve as the county's temporary replacement. An ending to an era in Hanover County leads to the appointment of an acting superintendent. The school board accepted the resignation of Superintendent Dr. Michael Gill. We're going to miss you here in Hanover. You did a great job. Um, I'm sorry to see you go. In a letter posted on the school division's website, Dr. Gill said in part, quote, I recognize that the school board has new goals and objectives it wishes to achieve. To accomplish this, a new leader is needed to work with the school board in these future endeavors. The sudden move disappointing some Hanover parents, but they tell me they are not surprised. The board wants somebody who aligns with them ideologically, and I don't think that he does in the way that they want him to. But one resident says the news caught him off guard. I was a little surprised because I didn't see it coming, didn't know what was going on. But at the same time, when you're at the top of your game, like with any sports uh, coach or anything, that's when you kind of want to retire. Now the school board has 180 days to find a permanent replacement. Until then... I move that Dr. Lisa Pennycuff be appointed interim superintendent of the Hanover County Public Schools, effective 5 August 2024, until a successor is approved. Dr. Lisa Pennycuff currently serves as the Prince George County Superintendent. According to a letter posted on the division's website, she was set to retire July 31st to help care for her mom. In a statement posted by Hanover School Division, Dr. Pennycuff says in part, quote, I am thankful to the Hanover County School Board for this opportunity to join the team of outstanding educators to serve the children, families, and community. Now, Hanover is just one of several counties in Central Virginia who are working to find a permanent replacement or a permanent superintendent uh, before the school year. And the county also says that their application process is now open. Live in Hanover, Chantel Davis, 12 on your side.